Hello, it's Ricardo, and I'm still playing Elite Dangerous Beyond. There's been an update in regards to the victims of INRA and the connection with the League of Reparation. Now, last week we posted that a council member had indeed been murdered, and now it started to escalate a bit more with another murder. A member of the Council of Admirals, which commands the Alliance Defence Force, has been murdered. The League of Reparation has claimed responsibility. Fleet Admiral Tullimac Buchanan was travelling to a naval ceremony at Lave Station when his private vessel was attacked and destroyed. The Admiral's personal staff and ship's crew were also killed. Moments later, the following message was transmitted across the galaxy. We do not forget the crimes of the Inra. We do not forgive those who carry their guilt. For Jameson. Is Laurie Jameson, the engineer, still in the frame for all this? We do not forgive those who carry their guilt. For Jameson. The Galna article continues with Chief Inspector Kay Kilbride, a founding member of the Tri's Superpower Task Force, investigating the League, delivered the following statement. We are treating this attack as an act of terrorism from the League of Reparation. Fleet Admiral Buchanan's family history verifies that one of his forebearers was a senior commander in the INRA prior to settling down on Lave over a century ago. We are working to identify the attackers who somehow managed to avoid local security forces. There's evidence to suggest that the League's assassins are being aided by a sympathetic individuals in positions of influence. Our investigation continues. Now the Lions Assembly released a joint statement. This is a sickening and cowardly act of aggression that has cost us dearly. Such brutal assault on our people and values cannot go unpunished. Is this going to be the start of some sort of super civil war? We don't know. Commodore Riri McAllister spoke on behalf of the Alliance Defence Force. A replacement member for the Council of Admirals will soon be appointed. In the meantime, we are all doing all we can to support the task force in tracking down these criminals. Well, I bet that came from the heart, didn't it? So, here's the questions. Do the Inra hierarchy need to be worried? Do their descendants need to leave town? More news as it breaks and the plot thickens. I've been Ricardo and this has been a news update on the assassination of the descendants of the commanders of Inra by the League of Reparation. Thanks very much for watching. Like and subscribe and check out more videos as they happen on YouTube.